Great Britain then, one of only two countries to have held a Grand Prix in every single year of the Formula One World Championship. And the circuit extends that record further for today's Grand Prix. The 3.6 miles of the Silverstone circuit in Great Britain is hallowed ground to the Formula One faithful. We have 18 corners that wrap around this former World War II airbase and some good passing opportunities at the end of the DRS zone. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box. Ant, it's fantastic to have you with us here today, but I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? But from the moment qualifying's over, you start to feel the adrenaline in your body build up and the buzz in your stomach as you anticipate the run down into Turn 1. It's all a bit like going into battle, and the unknown situation makes you nervous. Those pre-race nerves are a good thing. The day you don't have them means that you don't care anymore. And of course, you have to make sure that all the procedures are second nature to you so that they're not taking up too much of your capacity. It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. Van der Berg lines up on pole position and Mick Schumacher completes the front row. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Verstappen, Hamilton, Sergio Perez and Ricardo, Sainz, Norris, Fernando Alonso and Pierre Gasly, Matsushita, Vettel, Esteban Ocon and Stroll, Sonoda, Giovinazzi, George Russell and Kimi Raikkonen, Leclerc, Latifi, Eilert and Nikita Mazepin. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track.
plenty of action here at Silverstone. It was a memorable race, and what an impressive victory. Anthony Davidson, what helped them deliver this result, do you think? Well, this was a real team victory. They put together a solid strategy today that appeared well suited to the conditions out on track. The driver did everything that was expected of them in the moment to really execute the team's plan to perfection. A shining example of how F1 really is a team sport. Welcome then to the podium, our top three drivers. What a great effort from them today in a very difficult race.